Hi, it's Chris in the 4 News Now First Alert Weather Center on a dark and damp Wednesday night and cold. Uh, and tomorrow, it's not going to improve like I thought it would earlier in the week. Here are four things to know about your weather. It is going to be a cold, cloudy night with the possibility of a few snow flurries around the region. Nothing significant. Showers Thursday afternoon, and then we head into a warm, dry Saturday. Looking forward to that after a high today of 40. 59 is our average high. It wasn't an especially cold start to the day with the clouds in place, 36 in Spokane. On our forecast, we have high pressure trying to build in, but it is not going to have much success. Thus, we are going to see more moisture coming off the Pacific, giving us that next chance of showers tomorrow. We'll zoom in on our computer model for a closer look. Um, the last of the showers tonight slowly tapering off. The model wants to give us some clearing, which would allow the temperature to really plummet down into the 20s in many locations. Then some showers come through tomorrow afternoon, uh, falling in the form of rain and mountain snow. Overnight lows tonight will be down in the 20s and 30s around the region. High temperatures tomorrow will be in the 40s in eastern Washington and north Idaho, 50s as we head further to the west and down into the Lewiston area. Your seven day forecast, we have a warming trend, mostly cloudy Friday, 64 on Saturday with mostly sunny skies. We're going to get a nice uh, return to more seasonal conditions. Uh, chance of showers on Sunday, just a chance with a cold front passing through that will cool things down for Monday. But then we kick off a warming trend again on Tuesday. Wasn't quite ready for 40 degrees and rain today. That was, that was a bit of a shock. Uh, tricky forecast over the next 24 hours. Uh, oh, we'll see you back here tomorrow, see how it panned out, and uh, have some more insight into your weekend outlook. Uh, hope to see you then.